Yeah, we're going to show you how we checked out Comet Girard uh, this, evening, or this morning, actually it was. And let's see if we turn our auto stir on. And we went through the home position and all the settings to... Uh, okay, we're going to go to the menu mode. So i got to hit the mode button. Okay, we got the date, that's okay. We're not going to worry about the time now because we're doing this as a demo. Um, go past that. Let's see. Okay, we just pushed the mode button. We're switching to see. Uh, I want to show you how we uh, found the comet here. We're going to go to. We're just using the bottom switch here and then the mode button. Uh, we don't want the guided tour, we don't want the glossary. Utility setup, let's see, object, object I guess is what we want. So go back in the other button, go back to object, enter, and I want to again show you how we found the comet. Uh, we did by star, and we did um, not named, but we did it by SAO catalog. I uh, found out amazingly uh, most of the maps use. Use a different, I think it's Flamstead or something. And right now the comet is near 102. 102. But that's not going to work because this uses SAO settings. So I went to a conversion chart in the internet and put in the, uh, gosh, I'm trying to remember. I think it was, I'm going to put just a fictitious number. But I think it was an 80 number. 85, 69. That is not correct. So don't pay attention to that. Uh, we push enter first, then we put the correct uh, SAO number. I'm not putting the right one in. See, I did not found. But if you put the correct catalog SAO there, uh, and you find it a conversion chart, you'll have it uh, uh, work for you. And then uh, you just have the auto star go to the SAO converted uh, star and you'll be within a just about a degree degree and a half of where the Girard Comet is. Worked out beautifully last night. Went right to it.